What's up, PSG family? It's your boy PSG here with some urgent news. It doesn't look like this signing of Milan Skriniar will be done to Paris Saint Germain. PSG today met with Inter in meetings and discussions about Milan Skriniar and offered yet again 50 million plus bonuses, but Inter rejected as always, saying no, and they have already started preparing a new contract for Milan Skriniar extension with him only having one year left on his contract. For me, I'm not worried. I knew that the amount that Inter wanted was pretty much impossible for Paris Saint-Germain to pay. That's why we have been trying to do loan signings all the time for Ikitike as well, for Nunu last season. And uh, it's no worries for me because I know that we want a centre-back and we will get a centre-back. But it won't be Milan Skriniar, that's the only thing. But it also came out to report that PSG have exceeded their FFP limits and will have to, yeah, keep a tighter, even tighter budget. So we will see who the new centre-back is that's coming in and the new striker because I definitely believe that a centre-back and striker will definitely come in. It will not be Milan Skriniar and with PSG offering 50 million means that we have 50 million for another centre-back. So let's look at who Paris Saint-Germain can sign. Paris Saint-Germain can yet again go into league and, and try finding some player there. They can look in other leagues. Uh, but the names that have been linked with Fofana, for example, he's not happening because Leicester City value him too much. Sima Khan won't happen because Leipzig have said no. So maybe next summer even. Uh, Di Sassi, I don't think so. So we will just have to see and wait who the new centre-back for Paris Saint-Germain will be. But that was some quick urgent news from PSG. Make sure to subscribe to the PSG YouTube channel. Make sure to like this video for more special news. And other than that, make sure to have a nice day and as usual. Allez Paris!